There you go, guys. Subtle, but sleek. Subtle, but sleek. <laughs> we got Go-Kart Academy on the cars now, guys. One step at a time. Yo, what's up, guys? It is Go-Kart Academy at 893 Motorsports. We're hanging out here. Do some of you guys know where this is? the old and dready place that closed down unfortunately due to the market conditions so we're doing some research maybe this might be a great spot for a new go-karting track what do you say oh, man. bring it back baby <laughs> bring it back baby so we're doing a little bit of research checking it out guys you know we're always on the hunt we're building this thing intentionally and so we're going to be doing some stops today at a, another another place i don't know if we're allowed to say just yet but you'll see in the vlog uh, if we if we can we're checking out another uh, space that might be a place for us to rent with some cars and we had a great conversation this morning with a guy up in North Carolina that's in the karting world as well so growing our network doing everything we possibly can moving the needle one percent that's what it's all about guys so we're out here checking out Andretti you got to do on-site research to understand what the market opportunities are so join us for today's vlog guys and we'll see you as we cut See out there. <laughs> we are over here at Six Flags Whitewater. Some of you guys might remember. Some of you guys might remember this old go kart track that we're staring at here that you guys are looking at right now. How cool would it be to resurrect a little mini go kart track? It goes all the way back there too. Yeah. I have completely forgotten about this place. It's got a nice like little bend there, little angle. Oh yeah, it's banked. Pretty sweet, guys. Well, again, this is part of our job. Part of our work, guys, here is doing reconnaissance, research, learning everything that we can about racing, race carts, tracks, nitrogen. I'm trying to get an education here, guys. One of the best ways to get education, you gotta get, you gotta pound the ground. You gotta go out there and find what's out there so you can learn and get perspective gives you options and ideas and opportunities of what you can do. So for the few that are watching this, you're watching a real business launch. As we are going out and we are doing the hard work, getting in a car, researching stuff, meeting people, shaking hands. That's what you gotta do, guys. So we're checking this out here today. Can you get through? No? Yeah, you yeah, could. It's locked, so we don't want to. Thank you for visiting Whitewater Six Flags. Come back soon whenever you can. <laughs> it looks like zombie land to me right now. This is what we're doing, guys. Out pounding the pavement, learning as much as we can. Because we're in it to win it. We're going to be building something big here, guys. It's gonna, it might take, well, months, years. We'll get it done, though. That's what happens when you find the right people to work with. So where are we headed now? We're going to go pick up some swag. Oh, that's right. We're going to go pick up some swag, guys. So let's, we'll check out the swag, and you guys can come along with us. Peace. What's up, guys? We are at In The House. In The House. We're going to go check out some swag, pick up some stuff. Signs, banners, t-shirts, stickers, whatever you need. It's in the house. Okay. Tomorrow. He's just okay. starting to test for them today. Ooh. Okay, nice. Did you get my email about doing four, changing the two and two? So we just picked up some Go-Kart Academy stickers. We're gonna put one on here in this dirty car. That's exactly how you apply stickers to a car. You just wipe it off with your hand. <laughs> Booyah! There you go, guys. Subtle, but sleek. Subtle, but sleek. <laughs> we got Go-Kart Academy on the cars now, guys. One step at a time. 
We have been making the rounds. We just left Mountain Motorsports, hanging out with them a little bit, checking out some of their motorcycles and their Ducatis. Yeah. We were, we were actually having a conversation about whether we should get into them. What do you guys think? Should we get back into motorcycles? <laughs> but if you look over there, if you look over there, nitrogen. Now, why would we be looking into nitrogen? Is nitrogen legal to be? Is it legal to be pumping nitrogen into your uh, your go kart tires? Oh yeah, there's some head knots here. So maybe, just maybe, getting into nitrogen generation systems could be something that could be pretty cool. All right, we'll see. We'll see. All right, let's check it out. Hey, What's up, brother? Man. How you doing, good man? See you. Just checking out the spot. Yeah, we're. Uh... All right, guys, so, so Jonathan has just rolled up, the, uh, rolled up the car here, and we're gonna do some nitrogen testing on the car. So we're always researching, always learning. We're learning more about nitrogen than we've ever learned before. These nitrogen systems, there's some competitive advantages to running nitrogen in your tires. And we're- Cooler tire pressure. Cool, sorry. <laughs> You don't have to guess about how much tire pressure is going to go up on a hot track day. You have a cooler surface of the tire as it's going around the track. And you really just don't have to have that variable of how much the tire pressure is going to go up every time you go out. Depending on what time it was in the morning and what time it is going to be in the afternoon. Exactly. There's so many things that we've read and that we've learned about tire pressure, atmospheric temperature, all this stuff for making sure that your tires are exactly the right temp for the track and the conditions with nitrogen you remove yep. all of that shout out to leo up at Atlanta motorsports park and chad here taking care of us leo did some testing for us later earlier yep. this week and he absolutely loved it so nitrogen's the way to go guys yeah we're checking it out we're doing live testing again leo big shout out chad he over here with nitrogen t nitrogen systems is helping us learn about it experiment with it awesome stuff way guys way to go guys just finished pumping up this BMW i3 full of nitrogen with 98% purity, though they guarantee 95%, which is fine. Um, and we got some swag, check this out. So if you guys, if you guys come by, if you guys come by and you wanna get some nitrogen, fill you up with some nitrogen and some new valve caps, some new valve caps guys, free swag. So if you're heading out and you're hanging out at AMP and you want to try some nitrogen, we'd love to give you some nitrogen. I mean, it's technically free since it's just air. Yeah. <laughs> so come by, guys. Check it out. Hi. Again, big shout out to Chad and the N2G. Guys, check it out here. Giving us the, the, the valve caps right here. So check us out at AMP. Load you up with some nitrogen. Certainly see Chad some more. Uh, maybe come race day. Uh, we'll put some valve caps on there and put, hook you up with nitrogen, which from our test already with Leo, he, uh, he saves above and beyond. Hey. Lower tire temps, lower pressure rises. Yep. So you're hearing it from a real racer there, guys. So check us out. Again, Chad, N2G, guys. So that is the end of our vlog. Vlog number eight, guys, doing lots of research. Man. It's one of those things that you have to do. Now, the end of this vlog, uh, Jonathan and I actually stopped by a smoothie place and discussed some of the learnings around nitrogen and some of the um, conversations that we had with Chad. It, uh, for some reason, the file was corrupted. So what can I say? We're gonna end it off this way. But I hope that you guys are encouraged out there. And, and one of the reasons is, is we wanna invite you in on this journey that Jonathan and I are on. We're trying to make it as transparent as possible around what we're doing, who we're meeting, what we're learning, and what we're doing. There's a lot of things that we have dreams about. There's a lot of things that we want to create. There's a huge gap in the market, and we've talked about it on our vlogs before. We believe that there's an opportunity to lower the barrier to entry into enthusiast carding, more than just the rental experience. And certainly, there's no one in the Atlanta area that's doing it well. 
you know, I hope you guys um, hope you guys will stay tuned to our next vlog where Jonathan and I go up to GoPro for the first time and actually race. It's really exciting, so I'm going to be punching that out in a little bit, guys. But we are pounding the pavement. If if you if you haven't seen through the vlog, we are pounding the pavement, going to place to place to place, setting up meetings, having conversations on the phone, in person, going around. We have to get our education up quick. We got to learn quick. There's so much to learn when it comes to go-karting, the whole go-karting world, and especially if we're going to be building our own go-karting business. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And again, stay tuned for the next, the next video that's going to be coming out in a little bit around our adventures, heading up to North Carolina and GoPro. Guys, I'm glad that you're here. Make sure that you smash the like button. Make sure that you subscribe. And of course, join www.gokart.academy. Now we're collecting swag. Actually, there's a box right there. Let's see if I can do this right. There's a bo that box right there. That's right. That box right there is full of swag that we got from one of our sponsors and supporters, Italcart, Italian Motors. So we're going to be giving out swag soon enough. Guys, enjoy the day, stay safe out there, and we'll see you on the next one. Hey.